We do have a lot of news to get to the breakthrough on gun safety. People were marching across the country over the weekend in the wake of the spike in nationwide mass shootings. As a bar bipartisan group of senators reached a deal on a package of measures that is limited in scope, but would still be the most significant federal legislation on the issue in nearly 30 years. Congressional correspondent Rachel Scott is on Capitol Hill with the latest. Good morning, Rachel. George, good morning, and this deal is far more limited than what Democrats had hoped for. But after nearly 30 years of congressional inaction and another streak of violent mass shootings, a bipartisan group of senators said this time failure could not be an option. This morning, a bipartisan breakthrough after nationwide calls for reform. We will want gun control. We will want it now. Senators announced a deal on gun safety. Once the text is finalized, I will put this bill on the floor ASAP as soon as possible so that Congress can quickly act to do something meaningful against gun violence. In the wake of the Buffalo massacre that left 10 dead and in Uvalde where 19 children and two teachers lost their lives, 10 Republicans joining 10 Democrats proposing to strengthen background checks, allowing juvenile records to be screened for gun buyers under 21. Expand gun restrictions for convicted domestic violence abusers. Funding for states to enact red flag laws to temporarily take guns away from people considered dangerous and bolster school security and mental health programs. President Biden giving his stamp of approval. Lawmakers were under immense pressure to act. Thousands taking to the streets this weekend calling for change. Stop the violence! Stop the violence! With a deal in hand, Texas Republican Senator John Cornyn stating the tragedies in Uvalde and elsewhere cried out for action. And this morning, Parkland survivor David Hogg says this time may finally be different. It makes me want to cry like tears of happiness. This is just a first step. It's not the last. Senators have agreed on a framework, but this is far from a done deal. Senators will next have to draft this legislation. One Republican source telling me the details of this bill will be absolutely critical to making sure enough Republicans stay on board to get it across the finish line. Michael, they want to see the fine print. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.